Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us today here at Two Wheel Thunder TV. We're at the 51st Annual Cavalcade of Customs in Cincinnati, Ohio, demonstrating some of the new bikes that are around. And we want to talk about the bike that's here today, 2008 Ultra Harley-Davidson Classic. Some of the unique things that are about this bike that's uh, kind of special, bikes to envy, uh, a custom chromer in Columbus, Ohio, provided the wheels, stock Harley wheels, it's been chrome plated, seven layer chrome plated. Pia lights, if you do any kind of riding at night, these are invaluable. These are great lights, you gotta have them at any time of nighttime riding. These lights light up the road, throw a lot of light on the highway. Actually, you can actually see where you're going. National Cycle provided the windshield. It's an aerodynamic windshield. Actually spreads the wind away from you. When you're going down the highway and a truck is coming at you, it helps diffuse the wind a little bit for you. Also helps keep you from being sucked into the traffic beside of you. Jimmy Boynott's a local painter here in the greater Cincinnati area. This is a gentleman and his crew painted the bike. It took them 80 hours to paint the bike. Custom paint job, top to bottom. Titan Lifts is one of the corporations that work with us at Two Wheel Thunder TV. Provides the lift. This lift will hold up to 1,500 pounds. It goes all the way to the top, about 45 uh, inches high. As you go up this high, you have the opportunity to actually work on the bike without having to bend down and get on the ground. Another nice thing about the Titan Lifts is they have an extension, both on this side and the other side, where you can actually put a four-wheeler or possibly a trike on the, on the lift. Also, it has an extension. If you have a raked front end, you have a long bike, here's a way that you can cover that bike, put it on the lift, lift it up, and you be able to work on it. Arlen Ness, Arlen Ness products provided the Derby uh, Stage 2 air intake system for the bike. Custom Jeweler did all the Marine Corps engraving with the Eagle Globe and Anchor. Bob Enterprises, Bob Racing Corporation, Dennis Manning and his crew, Jennifer Eagle and all those wonderful folks at Bob provided the true dual stage uh, intake exhaust system for this. Came out in February, gives you the greatest sound that you can get out of a stage two air intake system for a stock Harley-Davidson motor with a fuel injection. You move on down, you'll see a custom seat. Actually, it's a standard Harley-Davidson seat. The pan is the same seat of the Harley-Davidson, but the, the foam has been taken out of the seat and been replaced with a, a very special gel, a gel padding. Makes long distance riding a lot more comfortable, a lot more durable, a lot more so, uh, comfortable on your tush, the distance that you ride. Vega Corporation, the people that provide the helmets, this is actually called a, a Vega Attitude Helmet. One of the cool things about the Vega helmets that I like is the drop down visor. You can actually go down the highway, drop the shield, and you don't have to be, keep changing sunglasses all the time. And it also comes in these nice cool colors. And our, our thanks to Vega. It's also ventilated all the way around. But Vega Duck makes a real good product. They also make some good riding gear. Check them out. Bikes to Envy is also the people who makes the custom seats. They make them in all different shades and colors. Uh, this one has to have a black marine vinyl with ostrich uh, inlaid. Makes it really nice. The other side is a lot more of the custom engraving uh, done by a jeweler friend of ours with the United States Marine Corps emblem on it. The rear wheel, again, is done by uh, Bikes to Envy with a seven layer plated chrome. The bike took first place in its class here at the Cavalcade of Customs. We want to say thank you to all the sponsors who helped put this bike together. A beautiful bike. It's not just a show bike, it's one of those bikes to ride. On the far end of the bike, one of the last things that, that we talk about on the bike is the antennas. There are a lot of different companies out there that make antennas. Antennas Concept is the one who put the antennas on the back of this bike. They're short, however they work. They're a lot better than the long range flip antennas that Harley Davidson has. You get a lot better reception from these bikes. Kiriakin provided the chrome. We appreciate those. So all the people who helped put this bike together make it the bike that it is. We say our appreciation to them. Our thanks to Bikes to Envy, Vega, National Cycle. Uh, again, 
uh, Bub Enterprises, Pia Lights, Jimmy Boyd and I, all the painters and chromers that worked on the bike. You did a great job.